Good morning, Facebookers and YouTubers. We're here in the Convergence Media and Theater Department of Louisiana College to do an experiment today. We have with us Miss Tabitha Huffman. Hey, Miss Tab. Hello. We're going to find out the alkalinity of water, right? Right. So why are we doing that? Okay, we're doing that because the opposite of alkaline is acidic. And I'm here to prove that most of our bottled waters that you guys spend so much money on is, are, is acidic and diseased bodies are the most acidic bodies so you want to have a balanced pH level um, and how do you how you do that is by everyone tries to drink a ton of water a day right um, but it doesn't mean you're drinking something healthy because you might be drinking acidic water okay so take a look at this chart orange means acidic is highly acidic um, going all the way to the purple which is high alkaline you want to keep your bodies at around just like 7.5 alkalinity which is neutral okay all right so we're gonna just test these waters now how we're we gonna test them Tab? we're gonna test them by putting these pH drops in these these are just simple pH drops to test the pH level and so we want the color to be purple purple the more purple the, the more better <laughs> <laughs> very good college professor thank you so first we've got Nestle Pure Nestle Life, Pure Life. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're just squirting some drops in. Nestle Pure Life, it's got a greenish color. So it's more on the acidic side. One. Super One Purified drinking water. Purified, ooh, not good. Super One. This is orange, it's yellow, orange. Yellow, orangey. And yes. according to our chart. Not good, okay. Too acidic. Kroger. Kroger. Kroger is, let's see kind of looking the same yeah so now we've got propel everyone loves propel right no who doesn't Ooh, not bad not bad it's more on the blue yeah it looks like it's blue so propel's not bad and so this is called crazy water crazy mm. water this is saying it has a ph level of 7.5 yeah it says it's alkaline water already it's already alkalinized okay Okay, not bad. Okay, and this says it has an alkaline level of 8.2. So this is a higher alkalinity. Okay. So this should be darker, like a more purple than this one. Let's see, see it better. This, this is Dasani. Dasani. Ooh, gosh, Dasani's kind of scaring me a little bit. Yeah. Essentia. Essentia. Is this from Switzerland or something? I don't know. Okay. It's essential. It says 9.5 pH. That is purple. pure purple. That is purple. So that's the highest one yet. So far. Highest yep. alkalinity. Mm -hmm. Smart water. Smart water is not so smart. <laughs> <laughs> Sad. And Boss is in like this beautiful glass. I thought this was a thing of bottle. perfume when we first came I in. I know, right? Yeah. Let's see. It's a Voss. Well, it's about as acidic as perfume is. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> right? Then Evian, okay, which Evian. is naive spelled backwards. <gasps> Evian, not bad. It's more it's neutral, little... right? Yeah. And then, what is this? This is like an inside out label. Yeah, this what is, is it fresh something. artesian water. Artesian water, okay. It's a bluish green. Bluish green. Okay, and, and so this is a special bottle here. This last. Yeah, this one. is a special bottle. This um, I have a machine at home that alkalinizes my water to about a twelve point five. Okay. So that's. So this is from your house this through is the machine. From my house through my machine. And so I have very purple water. Yeah, this is very purple. Mhm. Mm all right, so this is interesting. This is a good one. This is the tap water from the two towns that we kind of live in. Right. So, so this is Alexandria, Louisiana tap water. And just what you guys need to know about tap water is they are required by law to keep um, the water neutralized. Mm -hmm. So we don't know what they do to our water mm -hmm. here, our tap water. So it's probably going to be more neutral just because it is regulated. Cool. Let's see. Ooh, Alexandria. It's a little it's a bluish greenish. And then we have Pineville. Pineville. Tap water. Now let's take a look at who wins.
So as we can see, um, it looks like Easter in here right now. It looks like we can dye eggs. Um, but it looks like Essentia wins in terms of the highest pH in bottled waters, which is really good. Um, it's a 9.5. So either get a filtration system like mine or Essentia. buy Essentia. Everything else, I mean, you can stay with the blue. This is neutral. This is where your body needs to be. But the purple does help to um, regulate your body if you are if you eat a lot of acidic foods um, or just eat a lot of blueberries. And it looks like the, the store brands are probably the worst. Mm -hmm. So, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it, the alkalinity test of our waters, bottled water, city water, and a personal alkalinity unit for the home. You choose which one is best for you. For me, I think I'm going with Essentia.